Okay, so make yourself comfortable. And again, as we've done in two or three visualizations now, imagine that it's getting darker in here. And you can see yourself from across the room or, for abo or above. And you see the glow that's your energy around your body. And like you did last night, remember you have a box. So if things interfere, throw them in the box. Those are bots. That's if you want to an, an, analyze Mike, throw it in the box. And even bodily aches or pains, if you have them, go ahead and throw it in the box. And you can do that anytime during the regression. And you see the field around your body that's your aura and it glows. And like you did last night, with your intention, make that energy stronger and brighter. And as you do that, you can feel yourself get lighter. And a little more and you get lighter still. Let yourself deepen and relax deeper than you did last night. You can do that. Those of you who have wrinkled on your foreheads, I want you to let the wrinkles ease out. You're concentrating too hard. Relax and let it happen. This is a neat little gift of, to yourself. So feed that aura just a bit more energy. And you can feel yourself rise up off the cushion of the floor by about two inches. And with your intention, give it a little more and you can start feeling yourself float. This is a pleasant feeling. You're comfortable with that. Give yourself a little more intention, a little more energy in the field. And you feel yourself slowly rise. And like last night, you realize that the ceiling above us is no barrier. And so you float right through it. You may even feel the molecules as you pass through it. As you go higher, you float through the roof of this building. And you can see the glorious sign, uh, sunshine that's out there. And it makes you feel warm and comfortable. With your intention, Rise a little faster. Comfortable on your back. Sunshine on your body, your face. And as you go higher, you pass through a cloud layer. You can feel the water droplets as you pass through it. And up above the cloud layer shines the sun again. And you feel that the wind starts to blow you gently in one direction. For those who want an earth life, continue in that direction. The rest of you be ready to explore the universe. Go higher now, those that want to explore. And you feel yourself start to rise very quickly. You become aware of the earth way below you. It's a comfortable feeling and safe. Go 
going high now very quickly. And you look back and the earth is just a dot. And you zoom faster now, past the planets. That's Pluto. And you begin to become aware of the vast Milky Way galaxy below before you. And you know it's a safe universe. And now you're accelerating very fast. And you feel a shift in time and place. And you move to another location that draws you because you are there. A part of you exists there. A part of you you haven't met yet. And you're drawn in that direction. That direction may be space, or it may be a planet, or it may even be a star. But a part of you is in one of those locations. And you move there, and now you stop. And you're either in space, you're on a planet, or in a star. Allow yourself at the count of three to become aware of your new surroundings. Three, two, one. If all you do is feel it, feel it. If you can sense it or see it, then do that. Get a sense of what you are. Feel whether you're an energy being or whether you have a body. Become aware of that body. Is there something on the outside of the body? Feel the structure of the body if it is a solid body. Become aware now of your surroundings. What is the landscape? If it's space, you may become aware of energy forms. Perhaps light beings. Just globes of light. <coughs> or if it's a planet, you become aware of the terrain on the planet. Is it rocky? Is there a form of vegetation? Become aware if there are other species of alive on that planet. I want you to become aware now if there are others of your species in the area. Allow yourself to perceive back in time how were you formed and created. Come aware of what or who created you. Become aware of any organizational units that you're a part. That may be a family, or a Borg, or some other organizational system. At the count of three, become aware of what your task is, what your purpose is. Three, two, one. I want you either to see or to experience in some way that symbol that represents your name. You may see, you may see it or you may hear it. 
capture that. In this system, is there death? Transition to another state of being? If there's somebody else, someplace else that you go in this system, discover that now. In three, two, one. Understand the characteristics. Do you have emotions? Is there happiness? Satisfaction? Those things that you experience, realize that now. Step apart and look at yourself. How do you appear? If there's technology that you use, what is that technology? Get any other information that you want to get now. If there are relationships with others, understand them now. Get any other information you want at this time. If the life ends that existence, see it or understand it now. To count of three, understand how that existence impacts the you that is in this room, the body that's in this room. If there is a significance to that non-earth life for you today, the you in this room, Understand that connection. When you're ready to come back, raise your right index finger. I'm going to slowly count you back from 10. If you need to stay there a little longer to get information, then just stay there longer. And anyone that's ready to come back can come back. 10, 9, hold the information you received. Eight, seven, six, slowly coming back, five, four, retaining the experience, three, two, one.